Someday, I'll... F if tis a blacksmith you need, I can't help you. I'm retired, see? Oh ho! Tis a regalia sword you want restored, is it? That's a first. <laughs> All right, give us a look then. Now, here's a masterwork of craftsmanship if I e'er saw one. Not to blow my own horn, but uh, <laughs> I wager I'm the only blacksmith who could set this ailing steel to rights. But, as I've said, I've lain down my tools, and before you start begging, know that I don't intend to pick them back up. Well, why are you still standing there? Leave an old man in peace. Pardon, sir, but uh, I couldn't help overhearing your conversation with Brocker. You'll have to forgive him. He's been in a foul mood eh, since we got cut off from the fuel for our forge. Though, he's always been a bit crotchety, come to think of it. Enough cheek, you wool-brained wastrel. Now, I'm off to the tavern. Can I count on you to mind things here while I'm gone? Of course you can. You go enjoy yourself. Psst. Hang about, eh? When he's gone, you and I can talk. Twas special made to use glimmer coal, mined from a nearby cavern. Till the monsters settled in, that is. Neither of us can go anywhere near the place now. Listen, Brock is too proud to ask for help, but I'm not. Would you be willing to go out to the cavern and mine us up some glimmer coal? I'll take as much as you can carry. Should you succeed, I reckon he'll change his mind about restoring that blade of yours. Now, true to its name, glimmer coal emits a pale light. So you'll want to cast your eyes about for any glowing spots when you get to the cavern. Oh, suppose you'll be needing the name of the place. <laughs> Digger's Ruins, tis called. I'll count on you to bring lots of the stuff back. I have been waiting for you, Arisen. If we can procure some glimmer coal from Digger's ruins, Sir Broker ought to have a change of heart about the regalia sword. Pray, allow me to show you the way. The guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. I'll lead the way. Over here, Master. Did you lose sight of me? To the Hobgoblin!
One might confidently call that a resounding victory. Overconfidence is an enemy in and of itself. Let us instead strive to better ourselves with every... Remarkable synchronicity. Let us try for the same result with our next attack. Oh, we meet again. How fare you this day? Will you hear me out? I have a favor to beg. I suppose that's how it goes. Let me get that. Ours is a party of women, by and large. And yet no two of us are the same. I suppose we might as well gather what we can. down somewhat, but me thinks I can manage for the time being. I will protect you. retreats.
Over here, if you would. You might lurk anywhere. Wear every shadow and mind the ceiling. Be sure to keep your wits about you. Where there's a way in, there's a way out. I knew we'd put that cave behind us. Such dark depths take their toll on the spirits. Right you are. common reward. Frustratingly so. We cannot expect gleaming treasures round every corner. Forgive me, but I cannot guide you from here. I see a ladder yonder, but we can't reach it from here. We'll have to get up there and drop it down. Is a surprise.
The battle continues. Splendid. We are to retreat then? To charge ahead may be to rush headlong into danger. Let us take care to move as one. Remain alert, and naught shall catch us by surprise. Procure some glimmer coal from Digger's ruins. Sir Broker ought to have a change of heart about the regalia sword. Pray, allow me to show you the way. You have our gratitude. Lead the way. Only one among us could make use of this. Tis a quality piece of equipment. There's no harm in keeping it on hand till a use presents itself. Akvatol isn't far from here. Not a foe in sight. The rest of our journey will be an easy one. If we pray, light your lantern, Master. <laughs> we found a chest. Let us examine what it has to offer. This ought to suffice, unless you'd rather mine for more, Master.
true enough. We have slime to contend with. I see you've been drenched. Dry off as soon as you can. It is hard to find my footing in this darkness. I'll gather this. It might be of use.
was unaware such a solution existed. I assume my own master must be none the wiser. thing that perhaps we could make use of it it certainly bears inspection this ought to be more than enough glimical to satisfy the smith should we deliver it to sir Sarah? i take it you've some business with this person then pray follow me you have our gratitude lead the way would seem we have what we need to hand. Every little thing you find, and your pack will soon outweigh you. Well, I know it. Beware the four pinnacles of fury!
What's up there? I can't make much out from here, but I have a feeling it will be worth the climb. Master, I believe I could be of aid here. Might I be of assistance? Over here, if you please. We were very thorough. Whatever secrets this place held, to be ours now. Let us make for a safe location where we might regain our strength. As a matter of fact, every master I've ever served has favored different tactics. One party I joined consisted only of ranged specialists, each to their own. This isn't the way to our destination, but I presume you've a new one in mind. Lead on. This ought to be more than enough glimmer to satisfy the smith. Shall we deliver it to Sir Sara? 
If you would be so kind as to follow me, I shall take you to the one you seek. You have our gratitude. Lead the way. allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes. Over here, if you would. You're welcome to take whatever you like from my pack, Master. I'd gladly see you put what I find to good use. Beg pardon, sir, but you wouldn't happen to be Batali, would you? You're not? Oh, thank goodness. I have a favor to beg, and I dare say I oughtn't ask it of anyone but a fellow Vermundian. This letter must reach the hands of a man called Ernesto. I've heard tell he's stationed on Volcanic Island, 
but the road in that direction appears to have been blocked off. It would seem another route lies to the south, only it is plagued by monsters, and I dare not brave it myself. But you seem the capable sort. A soldier, I dare say. I'm sure such beasts would pose little trouble for one of your skill. Pray aid me in this matter, sir. I should not ask such an ordeal of you if I was not sorely desperate. Let us see this delivered swiftly and intact. Well, this simplifies matters. We've already got what's required here in our possession. Pray, follow me. You're back! Have you any glimmer call for me? Look at it all! This'll last us a good while. You've my gratitude. Brocka, we've got more glimmer call. Now we can reignite the forge. Tisn't the forge what needs igniting, girl, but your fool ears. I've told you, my smithing days ended when those monsters moved in. I've no use for glimmer coal anymore. I'm done, understand? I'll not hear another word about that rusted hunk of steel. If you're so keen to have it repaired, then see to it yourself. Oh, leave me be. My mattress beckons. Oh, I was certain he'd pick up his tools again if we only had more glimmer coal. My apologies for putting you to all that trouble, sir, but mayhap your efforts needn't go to waste. I could try my hand at repairing that sword for you, if you'd be agreeable. Way I see it, if old Brock is the only smith with the skill to see it done, then I'm your best hope, being as I'm his apprentice and all. Well, what say you? I'm grateful for your trust, sir. You'll soon see your faith was well placed. Um, mayhap not soon, as twere. I fear I'm a novice in the truest sense. I'll be needing some time. But I'll see it done all the same. You have my word. Mark me. This blade will be shining like a star by the time I'm finished with it. Sir Sara is apprentice to the legendary dwarven blacksmith. There's no doubt in my mind that she will succeed. We ought to deliver the letter to Sir Ernesto. We shall find him at the encampment on Agamemnon Volcanic Island. Methinks I know where to find the person you're looking for. The guide is most welcome. Now we shan't lose our way. to be called to your side, Arisen.
We must rest, though the sun is still up. Though our foes were familiar, our tactics were most novel. It was an edifying journey, all in all. I feel refreshed and ready for a new day. Come, we've much to be getting on with. A new day, a new perspective. We pawns cannot set foot in Batal without feeling the people's contempt for us. Take heart, for we are fulfilling our duty at... Draw near. All the better to see the show. Forgive me, but I've made nary a lick of progress toward restoring that sword of yours. The blade's make is as intricate as tis beautiful. Suppose that's why these things ne'er see battle, eh? If I only knew how to create this pattern on the steel, mayhap the rest had come easier. What are you jabbering about now? Oh, um... Uh, you're looking at the work of a blaze hammer. Tis a process scarce employed, but one befitting the prestige of a regalia sword. Honestly, girl, you're no apprentice of mine if you can't figure out aught as simple as that. Sorry, Brocker. Must have slipped my mind. But if these patterns were the work of a blaze hammer, mayhap that's what it'd take to fix the blade. If you've not heard the term, tis where you heat your hammer to extreme temperatures by dipping it in magma. Tis hardly air used since the hammers like to cool afore you can forge aught with it. Brock has explained the process to me, but I wonder if that's enough. It seems to will take a rather complex process to restore the sword, but I've no doubt that Sir Sara's up to the task. Right you are.
Knowing that the patterns on the sword were the work of a blaze hammer complicates matters somewhat. Suppose I'll sleep on it. Mayhap the answer will come to me on the morrow. Interested in my wares? Hoy! Looking. No need to overthink it. You can ch change it on a whim. You've naught to lose, and you might even make a new discovery. Many thanks. Well met, sir. If our destination is a distant one, travel by ox cart might be worth considering. It would allow us to save our strength, assuming we are not attacked, that is. A good sleep will ensure we are prepared for the morrow. Good morrow, everyone. Come, we've much to be getting on with. A new day, a new perspective. Interested in my wares? You're the one who brought that regalia sword here in the first place, I? I want a word. It's that fool apprentice of mine. I haven't seen her since yesterday. Knowing her, she skipped off to the mountain base cave on Volcanic Island to try her hand with a blaze hammer. It's the only place with enough heat, see? Since you're the one who inspired this nonsense, you'd best go find her. And bring her back in one piece, lest I ring my hammer against that hollow shell you call a skull. Now, I'm just not sorry. Not sorry. Oh, I could use 